I woke up, it was seven. I waited till 11 just to figure out that no one would call. I think I got a lot of friends, but I don't hear from them. What's another night on my own? When you're spending every day on your own. Welcome, welcome, one and all, to Kieran's wonderful shopping emporium show thing. And today we shall be reviewing three new ways to wipe your ass. Now the first way is pretty simple. It's called the twist. All you have to do is you take this piece of paper, you place it upon your anus, and you twist and pull, twist and pull. It is like the pinch in some ways, but it is different in, in, in it that it adds a little more fantasy to the wipe. If you feel like you're not getting too much out of your wipe, twist it a bit. Lovely. Now, the next one is called the scoop. Uh, the scoop is a favorite one of mine. When you feel like something is stuck down there, like it didn't all go down the way, down, down the toilet, all you have to do is take a piece of paper to check you see that there's something big, and and then you take it and you scoop, you scoop, you don't crush it, you scoop, and then you can throw it all away. Painless, easy. And the, f the final one, the final one, which I call the finisher, which is called the rub. The rub is, oh, the rub, what, 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 what things to say about the rub? The rub is when you finish everything down there, you can place the toilet paper upon the general direction of your art. It doesn't even have to be the asshole. It can be the surrounding region of the asshole. And you rub furiously. You rub, rub, rub. And once you've rubbed, you check, and ev everything is clean and perfect. It, and now, some people have told me that the rub can get a little vicious, a little burning down there. But if you want to finish off your 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 business in, in a fantastic way, I would suggest the rub. That is just my personal opinion, and that is it for today. Welcome, one and all, to the end of the wonderful Emporium show thingy of Kieran the Cam. Now, uh, as we always do, we shall end this with a, a, a little saying, and the saying is, if you see a crocodile, run for your life. Because those things, like, oh, shit, man. Okay, I mean, uh, lovely, lovely Wonder Emporium show. See you soon. B -b -b bye. <laughs>
Did you know that trees grew accordingly to the surrounding environment and how the winds make them, you know, bend? I wonder what happened to this tree. This tree seems to have suffered a lot. Like seriously, like, what's this? Okay, so the tree's growing, you know, normally, like whatever, and then suddenly, boom, not. I think we can analyze the tree from here. You see here, we have a knot. Now that clearly symbolizes that the tree was in pain. Of course, if we look a little higher, we see much many more knots, and the tree suddenly is trying to climb towards that window. Look at that, ooh, it must be mad at the house. I think, I think the tree is mad at the house, but it's a swimming pool. Oh, maybe it's trying to get water. Ooh, and what's about this one? Oh, look, the tree is mad at the, ooh. It's mad at the bike. Like, the bike can, like, move around and the tree is stuck here. Maybe that's why. Did you know that signposts grew according to the elements surrounding them? They're surrounding surroundings. What the fuck happened to this one? She likes me. A little bit. Not at all. Kinda. Passionately. Like a crazy. Like super fucking crazy. She loves me like super fucking crazy, guys. <laughs> Fusty. Oh, the unbelievable Fusty has come to the table and we're finally gonna be able to drench our quest of quench our thirst with Fusty. Oh my god. Oh, look at the ingredients. Let's look at the ingredients. We can't see anything, but I'm just gonna mix them up. Fuse. Oh, of course Fusty would be made with Fuse. Peach. Oh, this peach too. This, it's, this tea is made of Fuse and peach. Beautiful. Oh, this water. It seems we have come across a bunch of animals that are all doing very strange things. First of all, we have the monkey. It's looking straight at me. What's up, monkey, huh? What you got, monkey, huh? What you gonna do there, monkey? I'm above and you're below and you're just floating about. And I'm just up here. I'm using my legs, using my legs. You got no legs, monkey. What you what you gonna do? And then we have like this toad who seems to be praying, praying to God. And this chicken doesn't give a shit. He just stays there all day. Maybe, maybe he's praying for him to like lay a magic egg. Please, oh please, could you lay a magic egg for me? Oh no, I'm a chicken and I don't lay any magic eggs. Please, please lay a golden egg for me, please, please. Oh, I don't I don't do any, any golden eggs, man. What the fuck is wrong with you? And we have then this very weird pair of uh, swan, who seems to be right at home, and a pig with, uh, yeah, with, with gloves on his head. So uh, I'm not too sure what to make of that. The pig is slowly coming to realize that, I don't know, I don't know what he's doing there. He's like, what am I doing here? Why, why, who put gloves on my ears? I can't hear anything. And the swan's like, shut up. I just want to watch TV, man. I just want to watch TV. Oh yeah, but still, you would understand if you had gloves over your ears. I don't have any ears, man. I don't have any ears. La la la, we're all a bunch of friends, hanging in the water, hanging in the water. La la la, we're all a bunch of friends, hanging in the water, and fuck <laughs> Guys, if you like the video, you can go click uh, subscribe or you can like the video near the subscribe button. There's also a little bell that should be right here, and it will take you to the wonderful land of magical fairy tales. <laughs> no, it's just going to notify you when I post a video. Uh, you can also follow me uh, at Karen LeCam on uh, on Instagram and on Twitter. So I hope you you like that. Um, I should be there right now. If I'm not there, you can leave a message after the turn.
Why are you still here? Record your message. Oh, you know what? Whatever message you were going to record, put it down in the comments below. <laughs> we'll, see, we'll, we'll have fun 